Is it possible to create a city where traffic exists on the terms of its people? You fencing. You fencing. You fencing. You fencing. Geofencing is a technology that can regulate speed, emissions and access in dedicated zones. It creates safer, quieter streets and cleaner air and increases both passenger and driver comfort. And when it comes to geofencing, Gothenburg is leading the way. For the past six years, the city has tested the technology in real-life traffic as part of the Electricity Gothenburg project. On two bus routes, Geofencing zones have been used both to limit the vehicle speed and to ensure full electric drive mode in certain areas. Now, the city of Gothenburg, in close collaboration with Volvo buses, is taking it to the next level. The Urban Transport Administration has developed a unique digital platform which allows them to quickly create geofencing zones. As soon as a new zone is added to the system, it's available to download. The operator instantly receives information about new zones, which they can then apply to their buses. It's an easy and smooth process. The focus in the current project is testing speed zones in areas with many unprotected road users, like shopping streets, crossroads and schools. When the bus is entering a speed zone, the driver is notified and cannot increase the speed manually. Having a standardised geofencing platform offers quality assurance and makes the process more effective. It will also make it easier to scale up and include more vehicle types in the city. Because this is just the beginning. In Gothenburg, the goal is that geofencing will become a natural part of urban traffic management. And it's also about spreading the knowledge to other cities. Geofencing contributes to more livable and sustainable cities that are safe, clean, quiet and accessible on the terms of its people.